Welcome back to ESBR Boxing's YouTube channel. It's Niall, and I'm delighted tonight to be joined by Owen. And we're looking ahead to uh, the big uh, super lightweight clash this Saturday night between uh, Devin Haney and Ryan Garcia for the WBC super lightweight title at the Barclay Centre in Brooklyn. And we're here to give our uh, our tips on where the value might be for this in terms of betting. If you want to throw a few quid on where uh, where there might be a bit of money to be made. So, yeah, Owen, uh, let's jump straight in. I hope you're well, uh, first of all. And secondly, before we get into our tips for this one, just kind of just discuss kind of how excited you are for this one. You know, we're we're the two kind of Devin Haney super fans in the uh, ESBR, uh, myself and yourself. So it's I, I'm looking forward to seeing him out there against a, a top quality opponent and Ryan Garcia. How how excited are you for this one? Firstly, again, thank you for having me on. Um, it's, it's a weird one. Um. As soon as it got announced, I was excited as you can be for it. Um, and obviously Ryan Garcia's mental and concerning behaviour, a little bit of a dampener on it for me, but now he seems like he's back in the zone, his head's back in it, he, he's ready for fight now. Um, and it is, it's a great fight, you know. At this point now, Devin Haney's been undisputed um, at lightweight. I do think he'll go undisputed again at super lightweight. Um, and then I think he can he can carry on up into sort of welterweight. Um, but I think he's he's got that undisputed status and he, he's got a good record. But um, you know, obviously with Kambosos twice, Lomachenko, etc. But I think now there's a good chance to get a, a big name in the sport on his record. Um and yeah, it's it's a it's a super fight in terms of you've got the 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 pay-per-view star in Ryan Garcia who puts the bums on seats for um, arguably more outside of the ring than inside of the ring. You know, he's in terms of your boxers, he's one of the A listers, we'll say. Um, and then you've got Devin Haney, who, who for me is one of the, the pound for pound best on the planet. So it makes for a great fight, you know, outside the ring, inside the ring, the build up. Um, yeah, very excited for it. Um, and I won't give away too much of a prediction, but here's hoping Devin Haney continues. Yeah, I have to agree with what you said. I'm I'm looking forward to it myself. And as you mentioned, Ryan Garcia, his antics, if you will, has added more kind of intrigue to it with, with people in terms of what Ryan Garcia is going to turn up. Because say what you want about him, he can't fight. If he's fully focused, he can he can fight like hell. He's a he's a real quality operator. So hopefully we get the the best version of Ryan Garcia, you know, and he can get his own head sorted out because uh He's gonna to need to against against Devin Haney, as you mentioned, the pound for pound uh, superstar, really. So, yeah, let's let's dive into why we're why we're here. Um, discussing our betting tips and where the value might be. So I'll I'll let you kind of take the lead on this one in terms of what have you seen that's kind of caught your eye because it's an interesting fight to to pick out where the value is. I found when when looking at the kind of odds for this one and the. Uh, the stakes. So what what's caught your eye uh, in the build up to this one in terms of uh, betting value? I think like you say, Devin Haney's a clear market favourite. I think you can get around one to six on for him just to win the fight. Um and again it's odds on. I think I've seen as low as four to six for him to to win on points. Um as good as Devin Haney is um in terms of you know he, he's his performances and not having um the most amount of power I can see a Devin Haney stoppage in this um, I've said this in the build up I've said this in previous videos I've been highly confident um, that Devin Haney wins this fight however he wins it but I looked at a, a price of a knockout you know you can get 9-4 to four for a TKO but he's not going to blow him out of the water early if Devin Haney stops him I think it'll be an accumulation of punches it'll be a gradual breakdown um, of Ryan Garcia's arsenal, you know, I think it'll be Garcia coming forward, um, Haney almost dancing around him and, and breaking him down, and I can see a lot of body work coming from Devin Haney. So I I like Devin Haney in round seven to twelve at four to one. Um, I think it is quite hard to to find a good price for this fight. Um, and some people may think I'm crazy for for picking a Devin Haney stoppage, but. I'm not saying he's going to go in and, you know, he's going to one bomb him out, sort of, you know, land that big right hook or big left uppercut. It's highly unlikely, but 
I just think we can see a, a referee stoppage, you know, a, a TKO as it gets to rounds four, five, six, seven. I just see Devin Haney taking over, landing far too many punches. Um, Ryan Garcia's gas tank emptying from the, the breakdown um, of body shots. I, I, I feel Devin Haney will use. And yeah, I think four to one for me um, is not necessarily the biggest price, you know, not necessarily the best price for a Devin Haney stoppage. But I just think that may potentially be the fact of, you know, what, what I've said that maybe looked into. Um, and, you know, with Ryan Garcia's antics, they're always going to have effect, an effect on the odds in a negative way. But yeah, for me, four to one, round seven to 12, second half of the fight stoppage um, after a, a comfortable sort of cruising towards a points victory for Devin Haney for me. That's that's a very interesting show, actually. Uh, as you mentioned, the... Uh... The Devin Haney stoppage hasn't been uh, highly kind of touted. He's not that type of a fighter, and I, I can't personally, I don't think he will stop him. Personally, I think it will be a Devin Haney points win. Uh, you know, obviously Ryan Garcia stopped by Tank Davis, but Tank Davis is, is you know, plenty more powerful than Devin Haney is. But I do think Devin Haney will win on points. And as I mentioned before, the 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 power the the value isn't really there for a Devin Haney points win. But uh, I was looking, and this might be a surprising one, but I've gone it's, it's something that's caught my eye here is Devin Haney to be knocked down and win, but win the fight. You can get that at sixteen to one, and I think I might be throwing a couple of quid on that because <laughs> I can definitely see. I can see Ryan, Ryan Garcia has the power to hurt Devin Haney and I could see him clipping him early here. I really could. And we've seen Devin Haney get hit before. He's not an elusive kind of master at all. Lanara has rocked him. You know, we we all know that famous kind of clip in there for, of Lanara is putting him on the, the shaky legs. Lomachenko hit him at, kind of at will. Uh, Ryan Garcia hit harder than, than both of those. You know, Ryan Garcia can really punch. So I can see... Garcia having success early and clipping him and putting him down. And, you know, the 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 viewing audience thinking, well, could there be something on here? But I think Devin Haney would, would get up and, and outclass him then for the rest of the fight to win a points decision. But that's what I kind of like the look of here. I know it's a bit of a wild show, but Devin Haney to be knocked down and win the fight, which you can get at 16 to 1. So, yeah, I think I might be throwing, uh, throwing a couple of quid on that one, as I say. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, a few interesting prices there. Um, you know, you have uh, Owen who has Devin Haney stoppage uh, in round seven to twelve at four to one, or myself, uh, if Devin Haney to get clipped early, put down, but still win the fight at sixteen to one. So uh, yeah, that's our that's our betting tips for this one. You know, if you're if you're looking to throw a few quid on where the value might be, so let us know what you think in the comments. What will you be uh what will you be betting for this one, you know, and give us your predictions, who comes out on top. And as always, don't forget, drop a like on the video, uh, follow, you know, subscribe to the YouTube, follow our social media channels. Always great content coming up. And as always, uh just remember to gamble responsibly. And yeah, Owen, take care and speak again. Pleasure as always, mate. Cheers.